Welcome everybody. So I feel like y'all got some some duplicators. <laughs> I feel like y'all got some duplicators. Okay, y'all got some some people who um, admire you. I'm gonna say that. They copy you. They're watching. They've been watching everything that you have been doing. Especially, especially online. Whatever has been getting you attention, whatever has, uh, whatever you have created, whatever you have put your energy into, Someone could be trying to duplicate. Okay. Let's see. I told you. Flexing. Flexing. All about themselves. Selfish traits. Pride. Flashy. Arrogance. Insincere. And boasting. This person feels like you have been flexing. Okay. And they want you to stop. They want you to stop. They're trying to shut you down. See, they've been trolling you online. They have been trolling you, watching every move that you make, everything that you do. They want to do it too. It's kind of that anything you can do, I can do better type of energy. Type of vibe. Listen, bye Felicia. They want to dismiss you. They have been following your page. They have been following everything that you've been doing, following your every footstep. This is someone online. Okay? This is someone online. They feel like you have been flexing a lot. Mm -hmm. not, is it, it's not only one person. It's not only one person. It's a group of these damn trolls. It's a whole damn squad. It's a whole damn squad. I feel like some of y'all have been in an influencer position. You put yourself to be in a position to be an influencer. You're very, you got this go-getter, excuse me, you got this go-getter energy about yourself. You've been getting a lot of validation. Um, you may have a lot of people telling you, like, dang, look at that, that's so beautiful that's so cool what is it how do you do that you may have a lot of people doing it they sit around and they talk about you they gossiping about you a whole squad it's a whole team they team up a clique of friends a group a group it's a whole group of them they possibly even got a whole um group chat where they sit around talking about how they're gonna defeat you Y'all better get them people off y'all page. Get them people out y'all business. Get them people from around you. We got vibe. See, you been... <laughs> you a savage. Uh, classy, boozy. I'm talking about boozy. Classy, bougie, ratchet. Sassy, moody, was happy. See, y'all been being ruthless. Y'all been being too confident. This person trying to sit you down. This person trying to sit you down. They're trying to sit you down. They want you canceled. I want her canceled. Him canceled by tomorrow. We're going to have to whoop their ass. We're going to have to whoop their ass if we got to do what they got to do. If we got to pull tricks up out of our hats. We want them, we want them gone. We want them gone. They don't care what type of mind games they got to play. They come around you and act like they want to chill. And, you know, let's chill. Yeah, let's get together. Yeah, let's whoop the whoop, whoop the whoop, whoop, whoop. But the goal is to sit you down. Shut you down. You've been bossed up too much lately. 
They say your glow up is too real. So they got to throw some shade. They got to find something over here. They got to find something on you. Let's see. I want to use this deck here. Let's see. What's the real issue? What's this problem? What's this person's real issue? What is it? What's this person's real issue with my collector? What's this person's issue? How does this person feel about the collector? I'm getting a lot of jealousy, hate, but why? Why does this person feel like this about the collector? Why? What is their issue? Why? Tell me more. It's your beauty. It's your beauty. Somebody took some type of oath. Somebody took some type of oath here to put leave a dick, okay? They knew it was going to be risky. Somebody made some type of pack. We got obedience, fulfillment, rigid, high priestess of earth, trapped, loyalty, belonging, chaos. Tell me more. I knew beauty was going to come out. I had that feeling I was going to come out. Gosh, I do not like taking cards off the floor, but I got it here. This high priestess of earth, it came back out again. They're not going to stop until they succeed. They got something that they want to succeed in um, with trying to break you down. Grove, I feel like you're too successful. They don't understand your strength, where you get your strength from. They don't understand this. They don't understand it. They don't get it. This could be an earth sign. They don't understand it. They don't get it. They just don't get it. Because their life could be complicated. We got the fledging and complicated cycles. You may have, see, we got vision and love. This this person, tell me, tell me more about uh beauty here. We got the high priestess of spirit. You have a beautiful spirit. High priestess of air. Your thought process, the way you think. Somebody make choices off of lust. Maybe okay, cause I'm getting, I'm getting uh choices, movement, lust. I'm hearing somebody trying to remind you of who they are, or where they come from. This person made some type of promise to themselves, or made a pact with the damn devil. I don't know. This person made some type of pact. It's like something about this is forbidden because they know it's a risk to come up against you, to go up against you. But they 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 planning something out, okay, because we got success here. 
they're planning something out. They're frustrated because everything that you do, you're successful at it. Okay, they they don't understand that. Where do you get this this energy from? Where do you get this from? You're very beautiful, physically beautiful. Your spirit is beautiful. Your uh the air like everything about you, things that come out of your mouth, your thought process is just beautiful. Okay. They don't understand it. They want to come in and put some type of dent in that. They don't understand where you get this courage and this strength from. It completely bothers this person's spirit. It completely bothers this person's spirit. I want to see why Oath is here. And like I said, it's not just one person. It's a whole group of them. They made some type of pact to go after you. They made some type of agreement. Like, okay, well, we're going to all come up against her. Why is this uh, oath here? The magician. They could be doing fucking magic they could be doing magic they're doing spell work they made some type of pet I'm telling you and something happened fast they want something to happen quick so they could be happy with the results they are spying on you they want to see what you're saying what you what you what you know Look at this. Eight of Pentacles and the Five of Wands. This person is trying their hardest to put some type of dent in whatever it is that you got going. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Okay, listen. Giving you a heads up. Okay. The High Priest. This could be a Taurus. But the world is here. And then this is saying giving you a heads up. The Hermit. The nine of wands to watch out. Watch what you say. Two of wands and the page of the page of cups and the, this queen of pentacles. This queen of pentacles is here. This is that give you a heads up. Watch what you say to this person. Watch what you say around this person. Look at this, because they're going back. They're going back talking about you. Telling your secrets. Telling your secrets to the other people that uh, I'm getting two more people. They're just waiting, waiting, on, waiting to see your first move, what move you're going to make first, okay? This person can't keep up with you. They can't keep up with you right now, but they... They plan on it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It says, you think everybody is rooting for you, but they're not. They're not. I'm telling you, this person is on the behind the scenes, possibly doing some magic. Why? Tell me more about this magician. Oh, that jumped out. The hermit. It could be a Virgo. Look at this. The chariot and the uh, six of six of swords and the ten of swords. This is to stop your progress. This is to stop your progress. But it's like you see it coming. Some of y'all already have this have this vision of it. Okay, some of y'all already have some of y'all have visions or y'all already got this feeling. Some of y'all 
are very intuitive. Like for me, it's a lot of little things that will start to occur when some things are around the corner. Okay, it could be your eye just jumping. It could be you seeing certain number synchronicities. Synchron, 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 <laughs> You can have a dream. Um, it's just a lot of different things, okay? I feel like they try to block you, but some of y'all are, they feel like you're you're on to them. Tell me more. Oh, why is this hermit here and this magician? This person could try to make it seem like they're, oh, I'm so tired. Oh, when you come around them because they're avoiding you. Okay. This is somebody, I'm telling you, I'm getting a group of three. I'm getting a group of three. I'm getting three people. They feel like they might slip up and tell you something that, you know, I'm getting. I'm also hearing like they try to change the subject all the time. Like you be talking to this person, you and this person be talking, they change the subject. Somebody's waiting for someone to fall apart. Somebody's waiting for something to fall apart so somebody else can seem like they're better. I'm hearing, I've seen it firsthand. And don't somebody, somebody's like, don't take that risk. I'm hearing like somebody wants something bad to happen. Okay. I'm telling you, you got to watch out. Watch out now. Watch out what you're telling these people, what you're expressing to these people. If you got some type of plan or something that you're getting ready to do, sometimes you got to remove yourself from situations because if you can't if you can't be open around people and tell people your honest opinion on things that you're working towards things that's coming in for you if you have to keep silent you need to get those people from around you night of wands All right, let's talk about forbidding here because this is something else that I want to discuss. Why is forbidding here? Seven of Swords. I can't make this up. I'm telling you, this these people feel like this is their chance to slow you down. Yeah, like if they see you too excited, seeing you too happy, things are too stable for you. They try to come in and slow you down, change the rhythm of something that you got going on. But they be keeping quiet about it. Like, they just keep real quiet. But they're working behind the scenes. They're working behind the scenes. Like I told you, they sitting here spying on you. And then you're thinking that you're friends with these. I'm hearing three people. It's three people. You are uh, feeling like y'all are friends. But I'm telling you, I'm hearing no boo-boo. A bunch of seven of cups and a queen of wands want you to regret being so confident. I'm here and hope that new relationship fall apart too. 
if you just got in a new relationship, they're sitting here or sitting back, hoping that it falls apart. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Knight of Swords. This person is pissed, and this person is very much so in competition with you. With you, their their energy is: I gotta hurry up and do it before they do. I gotta hurry up and move quick. I gotta hurry up and get this done. Let me hurry up before they try to take my spot. You know, like I'm getting very, very rushed energy. This could be somebody in your family. We got the Ten of Pentacles here. Somebody can't make any moves right now because they are financially in a, a messed up situation. So they get upset when you're able to make moves before them. Um, so that's another reason why they um, could be upset. Now we got risk here as well. Five of Swords. They know it's a risk to go up against you. They know it's a risk to go up against you because you know you're very intuitive. You're very intuitive. Like I said, some of y'all really super duper uh, have these spiritual gifts. Like you can see things before they come. You can feel things. You can have a dream and this person, you know how to piece things together. Like a lot of things make sense to you. You can sense things before they happen. Okay. They know it's a risk. They know it's a risk to go up against you. I told you, some of y'all are psychic. High Priestess, Moon. Some of y'all have this spiritual gift, okay? I'm hearing thought that we was better than that, but I guess not. But I guess not. See, this person definitely is looking at you like you have the ability to shine. And you're shining, you're surpassing them. You're surpassing them, okay? They don't like how you feel like you could do it first. Like, oh, you think you could do that first? I thought of that first. Then they felt like they wanted to team up and work with you, but they feel like you're going to ask them for money. So that's out of the question. They feel like, when is it going to be their time? When is it When is it going to be their time? This is someone that goes to other people and they complain about you to other people. Like she, she thinks just because she got the money to do it, that she can do everything first. They think that she, she thinks that she, or like it's just a really big, you don't need that type of energy. As I'm doing this read right now, my eye has been jumping constantly. So you need to make sure that you figure out who this energy is because you need to go ahead and make a move. Go ahead and cut this energy off, okay? You don't need that type of energy, especially if you're pressing towards something. You got some type of goal in mind. You don't need that person's energy in your way or trying to stop you or hold you back, all right? You definitely don't. You definitely don't need that energy, all right? So, y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.